um, it's been around on and off for a bit for many years in Brazil because Brazil has um, uh, a lot of very very highly trained musicians and although Brazil has its you know, problems that we're always hearing about politically and, and, and economically and so forth what it does have is a very 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 um, sophisticated musical education system there's lots of people in Brazil and this is historical lots of people um, uh, uh, who play at least one or two instruments very very well so there's always a pool of young musicians who are looking for something to do now when things like bossa nova came along it was very the, the, the instrumentation was very very muted it was maybe a guitar a piano or something like that so you had all these incredible horn players who were sort of scuffling around for work so they were, I, I suppose, I mean, this is just my guess. They, they, whenever, they, whenever musicians like that hear a form of international music uh, that, that they can add to, that, they can, that they, can, they can adapt to, or they can, they can play, you know, their ears prick up. Um, and I think that's what's happened in the last sort of 20 years in Brazil. Um, the, this, the compilation that I've done here is really just a, a you know a, there's lots more you know it's the tip of the iceberg but it's uh, I think it's a reason, reasonably good bird's eye view of what's happening among uh, uh, among Brazilians certainly Brazilians in, in the city Brazilian musicians in the cities at the moment yeah